He did. Oh, it's stupid. It's stupid, stupid, stupid. No, people. It, it is funny that. when people on drugs try to outsmart someone who isn't. Like when they're like, no, no, he'll he'll go for the house thing, and then we'll still have the four, but you can be, you know, have your because di- the whole goal was for April push Kayla out, get Nick for herself. Like, and that's still, in my opinion, the goal. God, they're all playing like Game of Thrones, one D chess. Yeah, it's they're, like they're all so stupid. It's what on so earth? They're all like messing with each other. It's weird. It's weird. And I one of the weirdest things is when Kayla told me uh, she texted me one night. This was after I was gone, and she goes, "My night just took a terrible turn." She they, is such a manipulator. She goes, "I don't know this woman. I don't know Nick." This. Bullshit. She goes, they just let me look at uh, Nick's phone because Nick had looked through her phone and got mad at her for the text we were sending to each other. That was my last day there. So okay. that's when I started getting grilled about sex shit. And I was like, I'm uncomfortable. Um, so she, she texts me and she goes, he let me look at his phone. And the things him and April say about me are just really f- bad and they hurt really bad to read i'm like he's manipulating you he's showing you painful hurtful things to with your head look what we say about you but he (laughs) framed it as i'm doing this as a nice thing because i looked through your phone so here you can why would you fine Mm -hmm. why would you show someone you care about horrific horrible things you've said about them that's abusive it's creepy it's all up and then she turns to you it's like what's going right. on here? It's like I see Yeah, out. it's all manipulative. I uh yeah, I think it is all really bizarre. And with her situation with you, I, I I can't even it was it would be like it's almost like you're the white knight if 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 she has to turn to you and be like, You should have seen what they were saying about me. See, I'm in pain as well, Aaron. Well, the meanwhile they're like, yeah. go distract. In um, fairness, yeah. I don't think it it wasn't Aaron that was her white knight. It was not Nick. Like yeah. my name shouldn't have been Aaron in that situation. My name but should have I been think not that, Nick. I think it. He was. He was like, oh, here's what I'll do. I really just want April. I'm just gonna turn my wife onto this man. Yeah. It doesn't matter who it is, and make her believe that she's helping me if I do that. And then it's what it looks like. I'm you know. You know what it is, there. Kiana. You know what it is. It's two people not on drugs trying to figure out what three people on drugs are thinking. And I've learned in my life now, it's f-ing impossible. It's, it's, it's useless. It's impossible. Because you know what? We're probably wrong. It's probably more retarded than whatever we're thinking. <laughs> right. It's it's squirrel brain shit. I, I, I don't know. It so, is. So, you can only laugh about it because it's just so sad. It's so wild. <laughs> it's really just crazy to me. So then uh, the reason I, I kind of dredged all that up and the reason I told all those stories was because of the guy on Twitter kind of gave me some some he, fodder. Did he send you his DMs from? No, him? no, no. The guy. No, this was the guy on Twitter going, uh, uh, tweeting at me and going, you threw her out of the house and left her stuff out in the rain. I'm like, no, no, they got arrested, sweetheart. I, I don't know what to tell you. Yeah, so, it's really not my it fault. It was, yeah. oh, and then, um, so we know the story about how I gave her a few hours to go through the house and take whatever she wanted, right? Yes, I heard that too. Okay. And and then after they get arrested. And you do, you weren't even in the house. And then I when wasn't, they came yeah, back. Yeah, I wasn't even home. Yeah. And she left a lot more stuff than I thought she would. And I thanked her for that. That was the day we had that really nice text back and forth about we're sorry it got here. She's like, I cried in my mom's arms in the driveway. And Burr. Bubba, and blah 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 blah, and I'm like, wow, this is really nice. I haven't talked to this person in months. And then, and when like, she I got said, home, it was a different. Yeah. Oh, were they like paragraphed text messages? They were all... Oh, yep. I have them all. Sounds well, someday, someday yeah. we will see them. We'll go through them because. Oh, and we'll compare. Yeah, a lot of horse shit from one camp, but um, <laughs> uh, I. So, yeah, so she goes through, she takes what she wants. And that was the agreement. Go through one time, take what you want. Then they get arrested. All this shit starts happening. And, I, and you know, after I told her what you and Gino told her, which was you got to get away from people. This is going to be, this is going to end bad for you. Uh, she starts just going off and tearing into me. Then I fight and then she fights. Blah, blah. So finally, I just said, let's just talk through my lawyer. I can't handle this shit. Just talk to him. Blah, blah, blah. Yeah. So then she... The next Thursday, she's going to come get the rest of the stuff that's in the driveway. Um, 
I she start, she sends this list then to my lawyer of all this stuff she didn't take the first time through. Now she decides she wants it and she's putting dollar figures. Oh, next you know to who it. that sounds like? Who? Anyone but April. <laughs> right. She she's not like she used to not be like that. She puts all this stuff up there and dollar amounts next to it. And I wonder I should go back mm. in my text and add up the dollar amounts of all that stuff and see if it equals the amount of money she took. That would be interesting. Could be. Could be. That could be it. Interesting. So yeah. then she says that. I don't even that... think that's her. Again, yeah. I mean, who, how, who's to say that that wasn't uh, yeah. knit you, going? You should do this. You <laughs> don't. Wait, so you don't think it was April that asked for an NDA with the divorce? No, uh, no, Aaron, I don't. Oh, I don't. Okay. I don't want to shock you, but I don't oh. think that. I don't oh. think that uh, a lot of the text messages that have been being sent out by April are actually, in fact, her. But, God damn. Uh, it's just me. Silly me. So weird. Silly me. Uh, so she puts all these items in there and puts dollar amounts next to them. And I tell my lawyer, I go, no. She, I gave, like, I, I'm not going to be walked over on this one. I gave her hours and hours. I drove around. I went shopping. I did all this stuff so she could have a run of the house. I gave her a run of the house. And then they had gotten arrested. And I went, since they've been arrested, no offense. And I leave my lawyer's name out of it. But I said, no offense. I don't want them in the house. I don't want them in the garage. I just don't want them around any of my shit. Like, they, they've been arrested. Shit's been said. You know, there's a lot of bad blood. I, I don't want them anywhere near shit they can steal. Because you don't know what people in that condition can do. So, Not only that, uh, didn't, you know... Uh, Mr. Ricada accidentally leave a, a bullet of blow in your house before? Only next to the four. Be, only next to the four-year-old. Next to the four-year-old. No. I think it'd be safe to say, yeah. Uh, you know, I don't really feel comfortable now that I'm sort of in my yeah. right mind here. Yeah. So then, but, uh, uh, there's that, and then I tell my lawyer, I go and let her know I don't want those two at my f-ing house. I don't want those two at my f-ing house. Absolutely not. Blah blah blah. Well, then we find out through. Uh, here, how do I say this? We find out through text messages she sent about me that they were there. And she said, Aaron said I was there until 945. I said, no, I didn't. I said, a fan wrote in and said they saw you at a gas station around 945 and they thought you looked like shit. I read that on the air. She's like, and he's reporting my whereabouts. I'm like, I'm not reporting your whereabouts. People tell stories about where you were one night and they saw you in public. That's not telling people your whereabouts. So it's getting kind of unhinged and crazy. And I'm glad I didn't let them in the house or let them in the garage. But the fact that they showed up, she's she's mad. Remember, Nick wrote those messages. He agreed that he'd leave the shit in the garage. I ain't leaving shit in the garage for addicts to pick through. I'm sorry. I've gotten a lot smarter when it comes to addicts in the last couple of months. I've learned a lot. I'm not letting them near my shit. So I'm leaving the stuff out in the garage. You said that those people wouldn't be there. They were there. You let that slip. Because yeah. we're good at keeping secrets when we're in that uh, condition. 